I think that, um, yeah, we'll talk about that another time. But I feel like if your your child is homeschooled and different things, that you get to show them the world. You get to make new friends. They learn how to speak to adults as well so that they're not fearful of adults. Um, the socialization, socialization in school sometimes, not in all cases, is sit down, shut up, don't talk during lunchtime, don't talk in the classroom, don't talk da-da-da-da. That's not socializing. Um, that's not. OK, and then there are wonderful mm-hmm. um, schools out there where um, children do get to actually talk with each other and play with each other and learn, um, you know, different skills with their friends, which is awesome. So it can go both ways. But if you had to pull your children, your child, your children out, or if you did it for other reasons, you know, how do they say you do you? I think that's on this book I have. Do what works for your family. Do and and be okay with that. Be okay with what works for your family. And it's a process and things change. Today you may be doing it this way. Tomorrow you may do it that way. Um, Look for the resources. There's another resource called Positive Parenting. I think it's PositiveParenting.com. I'm putting another plug in because I want to give you resources that are helpful. It's not the end all be all, but sometimes you can just pull something out of it. There's positive parenting. And what's the other one? Oh, my gosh. Lemon. I can't think of it. I'll come back on and give it to you another time. I feel like it's Lemon Lime Adventures or something like that. Um, And they talk about children, um, parents, um, children with exceptionalities. Just look for lemon, you know, special needs. Um, But yeah. Yeah. But you're great. You're great. You're awesome. Okay. Let the tears flow when you need to. Wipe them away. And go ahead and and be brave all over again every single day because that's what you do. You're resilient, you're brave. And our, our children and our loved ones need us to do exactly what it is that we get to do for them. And it is a blessing. And and don't, don't feel like you have to rush and, and do this and that and the other. If you have to make changes and adapt, your life has changed. Do not try to continue um, feeling like, You have to be like this superhero of a person and you got to keep up with the Joneses, whoever the Joneses are. Do what works for you and measure your life by um, what God says, um, what God says he wants you to do. Measure it by your family, what works for your family, what makes your family happy, not what makes other people happy for your family all the time, but what makes your family happy. And if that means sitting down, playing a game of Uno Dare when other people are doing other things and you don't feel like going anyway, you don't always have to show up. Sometimes you just need to relax. Sometimes you just need to be, have your happy moment in your happy space with your happy family. All right. Okay. That's it for today. All right. And if you know a caregiver, can you call them today? Can And I don't mean... Tell them, do this, that, and the third. Someone said, oh, it it broke my, what is it? It's a whole lot of stuff I need to talk to y'all about. Those of you, your children have disability and stuff, um, and your lives have changed, and you're just trying to figure it out. You're going to figure it out, okay? And and whatever I can say to help, because I'm figuring it out too, Um, you know, your, your finances change with things like that. I know some of you may even be struggling in the sound of my voice, but don't quit. Keep going don't give up, right? The answers come. You just have to search it out. And and I pray that you meet the right people um, who are going to help you even out with that. So enjoy the rest of your day. Um, Keep on praying and have faith. Know that you are loved. Know that you're awesome. I just want to give you one more. I just want to for you and your children. All right now, this is Yudita Span and this is Epilepsy and Your Special Needs Podcast. Uh, join in, tune in to the next episode and go on the other pages and listen to the pep talk uh, with Yudita Podcast. That's where I just get to encourage you from the book I wrote and some other things. And then there's Real Talk and I think this is Real Talk too. All right, later.